What's up, guys? It's CF Fan. My name is Connor. Welcome back to CF Fan Nation. It has been a long, long minute since I've done these reactions. It's been a long minute, but I am back. Back to doing reactions. I've got a brand new schedule setting it up for this train for this channel my friend um the patreon is now officially set up so we'll be we starting setting up our patreon uh right away so if you want to support me go to the link in the description down below and i am streaming uh, three days a week monday wednesday friday on twitch and i'll be posting my my uh my reactions on saturday and i will be posting my gaming um my gaming videos which i'm coming back to do again on Sunday, so make sure you check that out. Check out the gaming channel, see if I'm gaming. We links to script below. But before we do that, we have a requested reaction that's been requested for such a long time. I never got a chance to do it, but now since we're back, let's we'll start with that first. We're going to do Wilfred Mother Loving War Staff by Markiplier. This is an older video that came out. Well, it's not too old, it came out in August. I know it was old, it's a year. Ooh, it's a year old, but Someone requested me to watch this, a good friend of mine requested me to watch this, and I've been holding it off because I'm trying to adjust my schedule, but since we are adjusted, we'll go back to it, so let's check it out. Make sure to check out the original video in the description down below, and let's go! Alright. Hmm. I've never been much for smoking, but taking a bullet to the chest will make you a lot less worried about the slow deaths of the world. Long story short, I took a job I shouldn't have. They say the pretty ones will always get you killed, but he was so damn handsome I just couldn't resist. <laughs> I was what? a frog in a slow pot of boiling water, or the first clown to get into the clown car. You don't know to get out until it's too late. One thing led to another, and I found myself slow dancing with the devil in the moonlight. Except instead of leaving room for Jesus, he left room for a 357 Magnum. I won't bore you with the details, so I'll cut right to the quick. A cut right to the quick! Because of this man. <clears throat> William J. Damn it. Come on. William J. Barnum, aka the Colonel. Mm. Just like the clown at my bar mitzvah, I knew he was trouble from the moment I laid eyes on him. And just like Bozo the Magnificent, a lot of people died when he walked into my life. <laughs> I've been chasing him down ever since. We were like two naked men running on the same treadmill, uncomfortably close, <laughs> but always just a step behind. But no one can run forever. Especially not with 200 pounds of sweaty detective breathing down your neck. Okay. It hasn't been easy though. I can't count how many countries I've cornered him in. Couldn't tell you how many <laughs> can't get the damn thing over. Strong hands. Every time I think I've got him for good, he somehow manages to slip away. But he's running out of holes to hide in. I mean that literally, metaphorically, and euphemistically. It doesn't matter how crafty you think you are. If you've been on the run for years and years, <laughs> All right, perfect. eventually, Thanks. you're gonna make a mistake. Word of advice, if you're running away from your problems, never become too attached to anything. Family, lovers, briefcases on top of your car. Some things are <laughs> best left behind. The Colonel's a slippery one, shedding names as easily as a snake sheds a few pounds before bikini season. He's gone mm. through pseudonym after pseudonym trying to cover his tracks, but he always manages to fall back into the same familiar roles. Drinking, fighting, flirting, dancing. Dancing. <laughs> so he likes to dance. Interesting. Centrics. 
but his latest persona takes the entire cake shop. Wilford, mother loving, wolf stash. Oh, stop! 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 Oh my god! <laughs> No, you can't get through. Down on the ground. Do I know you, friend? I said get down on What? How do you not stop playing games? Get your ass down on the ground what? before I blow you right here, right now. Away. Dave? Dave! Dave. Dave. Greg. Steve. Bill. Dave! I knew I recognized you. How are you? How's the wife? I don't have a wife. Stop stalling! You're under arrest for the murder of way too many people to even count! Well, that's just ridiculous. I would never kill anybody. Oh, is that right? Well, whatever you say, buddy. He's like, cool with it. You ran a real good race there, buddy. <clears throat> but it's the end of the road for you. The law's gonna throw every book they have at you. And after that, they're gonna throw you in a cell. And after that, they're gonna throw away the key. And after that, they're gonna throw that cell into a lake. Okay. But not before I throw a few things at him first. We're gonna play pin the tail on the donkey. But he's the donkey, and the tail is my feelings. What? But I shouldn't get ahead of myself. I only I'm... get one night with him to fill the hole in my heart he left behind. It's finally time to get some answers. Did we date at some point? No, we didn't date. <laughs> the hole was a metaphor when you shot me in the... Holy shit, that was close. We could have taken them. What the hell does that have to do with... How did you... How are you... How many fingers am I holding up? Four. Aardvark. Pumpernickel. What are you doing? Calabasas. Are you okay? How are you in my head? Why are you shouting? Get out of my head! You're still shouting! <laughs> I I am confused, but it, that's funny. <laughs> Enough keys. Your ass is mine for the next twenty-four hours, mm. and I'm gonna take my sweet time with that ass <laughs> to get answers out of it from you. Well, well, I I suppose I could stay here a while, get comfortable. Lovely place you've got here. Could you use a bit more color? Enough with your bullshit. Do you have any remorse? Any remorse at all for the things you've done? Or are you too much of a coward to face your crimes? 
Well, there's no need for name calling. Words can hurt, you know. You should be kind and courteous. Name calling, huh? <laughs> and uh, what name would you prefer, huh? <laughs> he still can't get that open. Is it William J. Butterfield? Well, well now there's a name I have. Wilson Jackson Bartholomew the Third. Well, now I actually married in it. Wingleheimer. Wait, just Wingleheimer? Alright, I may have been having a little bit of fun with that one. Oh. Name after name after name after name, just so you could distance yourself from the real name you should be called. Murderer. Abe. Abe. Abe, it's been years. How are you? How are you doing? How's the family? I'm doing just peachy, buddy, because I've been waiting a long, long time for this day to come so we could sit down, have a chat, catch up, good and proper. Wow. There we all are. How the hell did you do that? We look so young. You better get your ass back in that chair. Also, how did you get your ass out of that chair? You're going to tell me. You're going to tell me how you got your ass out of that chair so I can figure out a way to get it back in that chair. Oh, there's Celine. My heart still beats for her to this day. But if she saw me, she'd probably carve mine out. <laughs> what? How did you find all this? I, I, I've always had them. I've been collecting them. Every single scrap of evidence this whole time so that one day I could bring you down. That's so sweet. It's not sweet, that's sickening. Sickeningly sweet? That's not what I meant. Look, I am terribly, terribly sorry that I didn't remember you. Memories start to get jumbled after a while. Sometimes I forget even the simplest of things. Oh, trust me. You'll have plenty of time to think about all the horrible things you've done once they throw you in a cage, then throw away the key, and then throw that... How the hell do you keep doing that? Things get jumbled so easily. The when, the where, the why, the how of it all. Who can keep track of it? I wonder what he's up to. Is he? Maybe I should stop. You seriously need to get back in the chair. I, I, I've got more rope. Maybe that'll work. Yeah, worth a shot. Oh, the train. Oh, I remember the train. How long were we stuck in the snow for? Oh, you don't remember? That's ah, okay. Probably hasn't happened yet. Oh. But some of your finest work, I have to say. A uh, little spoiler alert for later to make it easier on you. We all did it. <laughs> I don't understand. <laughs> Not now. The grown-ups are talking. Save that for later. What the hell is going on? Whoa. Well, hmm. I don't really know. Honestly, I, I, I don't understand anything anymore. But I do remember you, and I remember that there's something I've been meaning to give you after all these years. <laughs> Get off him! If there's one thing I've learned after all these years, it's that nothing feels like a good apology. I don't understand anything anymore. Exactly! None of this makes any sense. That's the beauty of it. Beauty? What about any of this is beautiful to you? What kind of sick, twisted son of a bitch thinks any of this is beautiful? Now, what did we say about name calls? You yes. killed people! So many people! You killed my friends. You killed my partner. You shot me! Now, it seems to me like you're trying to paint me as the bad guy. You are the bad guy! Okay, whoa, hey, whoa, time out, time out, time out. Two, uh, whoa, hey, woo, ha, hey, hey, time out. I get it. You've been hunting me. For years and years and years, you've been chasing me all around the world. Uh, from uh, bedrooms to bathrooms to ballrooms. You've been chasing me, and you've been doing a real bang-up job of it. But... And, and forgive me if this sounds insulting in any way. 
What would you say our, uh, our, our closest encounter was before this very moment right here? When was our closest encounter? Yeah, yeah. Before this very moment? Yes. That's easy. It was when we... When we, uh, you... You know, it was when you, um, that's when you, uh, <clears throat> hmm. I was hunting you down. I was stalking you. But you fled the country to, uh, um, all right, all right. Yeah, 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 yeah. You, you, were, you were off the radar for three years, but I got a hot tip that you shacked up in, uh, in, um, uh, you shacked up with, in, mm. uh, uh, with uh, three years, uh, what year was that exactly? What, what year? Yeah. Well, it, it, well uh, it, it was in, uh, it was in, um, it, it was, uh, well, he can't remember. I've obsessed over this case for uh, years. Every moment of every day spent trying to hunt you down. So why can't I remember? Am I crazy? No, 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 no. no. My friend, you are not crazy. Don't let anyone ever tell you that you're crazy. You, you're just too focused on the minutia of it, the details, the who killed who, the who slept with who. It, you're not focusing on the big picture. It's impossible to know things that haven't happened yet. Yes, exactly. Just like it's impossible to survive a bullet through the heart. Whoa. This was all a nightmare that I couldn't wake up from. My heart was pounding Morse code in my ears, but I never learned the language. My mind was like a hamster ball rolling down the freeway. No matter how fast I went, I couldn't keep up with the flow. It was my first year of clown college all over again, and no, I... No, 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 no. No drifting off just yet. Listen, friend. It was a bit of a shock for me, too. Life needed a bit of madness, but... Why should death be any different? But I think the stress is getting to you a little bit. You need to unwind. You're, you're a freshly born farm trying to find your legs in a world that doesn't make sense. So just for tonight, let's forget about all the, the, the chasing and the killing and the shooty, shooty, bang, bang, God, you're a murderer. <laughs> and just for tonight, why don't we have a little fun? Interesting. That's very interesting. She okay, so she told me to watch to the very end. Usually I would pause after this, but I'm gonna watch till the end. This is a predecessor to um who killed Markiplier. Ha <laughs> <laughs> 
I guess that's it. Well, that was really interesting. Um, there's a lot of, you know, probably unpacking with that, probably towards the story of the uh, Luca Markiplier. I think maybe this was in his mind, or he was at the point of death, because he said he's down, he shot a bolt in the heart, and he can't remember any of this stuff. So I'm wondering if it has to do with. Um, Know. You guys can tell me in the comments down below what you guys think about this. This, you know, can you make sense of this? But this is very interesting. I thank you for it. I'm actually got to do it. So, thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure you subscribe to see if I miss you, brother. I'll see you guys next time. Peace.